Todd starts off with, there's a charity, um, and the guest of honor is Helen Keller. And um, to get everyone's sort of insight into what she goes through, they have a dinner, and part of the uh, dinner experience, it, it's in complete darkness, so nobody can see um, what is happening. And of course, at that point, that's when something evil happens. Having Alexander Graham Bell back as one of our characters, and, and now Helen Keller, um, and, and sort of the tie-in, the fact that uh, Bell's wife was deaf, it, it was a really neat tie-in, I thought. I think it's really special when we uh, deal with great historical characters, but in particular female characters who was just so groundbreaking, not only in her um, way of breaking through her own disability, and but helping other people with disability and sort of changing the world's perception of disability or bringing it at least to the awareness of people. She's a really incredible feminist character from history, so I love it when they bring those people on board. I understand you can read lips. And I can. But I make mistakes. <laughs> well, first of all, I really wanted to portray her as somebody that other people admired. I was reading a book and it said every time Helen Keller would walk into a room, all eyes were on her. And I wanted to play that, so I, I had to find the balance and I didn't want to lose that admiration that people had for her. When I remember when I was young, we all saw the, the, the movie came on TV, the Helen Keller story. And we all saw it, everybody saw it. And I don't know if that sort of awareness is existent with, with the kids today, but, but hopefully, if, yeah, if this, if this does anything to sort of keep that remarkable, that transcendental, triumphant story alive. She paved the way. If it wasn't for her and her voice, for the voiceless, I don't think we would be where we are today. So I think she was a true inspiration to someone who thought, oh, I, I, I can't do something because of this. And she said, you can do anything you want. You are a viable part of the society. <laughs>